Welcome everybody. Today I'm going to demo the Marshall Dual that I've got finally done. And de uh, so you heard a teeny bit of it before, but I'll start off with uh, the switch. With the switch down, it's on the Plexi channel. I've got it up, both of them up just about a quarter of the way up. So this is just kind of a clean tone. <laughs> So that's it, just a little clean tone. Let me try and get crank it up a little bit more. Got some nice crunch to it. Um, this is the bright switch that I've added, as I mentioned, so it's just To me, that's almost too harsh, but you want the bright switch really for when you're using a, a humbucker. We'll test that out in a minute. But. All right, so then if I go all the way to max again. By the way, I have the master volume, and it is only set up maybe less than a quarter. Uh, you can see my presence is most of the way up, but backed off a little. My bass is most of the way up, backed off a little. Mid is just a little to the right of top, and treble is about three quarters. So that's, that's where I'm liking it. So. so let's go up to almost max volume here. Alright, so you can hear that it gets pretty heavy. All the way at max, it tends to not quite sound as nice to me, but I'll put it all the way to max volume. So it's getting a little bit muddier at max. So that is the Plexi channel. We'll go ahead and turn that down, and we're going to switch over to the uh, the 2203, 2204 channel, and that volume is a little low, so we'll bring that up a bit. It's pretty quiet there, but if I bring the volume up, and if I dime it, it's actually kind of being quiet. I don't know why. It seems like it should be. It's a double gain channel. I'm wondering if uh, it's a little. That has a little bit different kind of crunch to it, but you know. So let me bring it, so that's at two thirds. And then if I dime it. So this one doesn't seem to have quite as much gain to me almost as the Plexi does, which I thought was the opposite of the way it should be. Unless I'm doing something goofy. Let me just try something. Nothing there. Nothing there. Alright, so if we switch channels. So that's one of the odd things. I get a little bit of interaction. Very quiet, but with the Plexi channel. But at max, it is, you know, it does have some... I guess it's kind of just a, it's a cascaded gain stage and it has a bit of a different gain structure maybe as part of what it is. So. But, but it also seems a bit quieter to me, I don't know why, than the, like if I were to jump over to the back to the Plexi, uh, up both, both of those channels up. Well, I don't know, maybe it's not volume, but it's more, it's just meteor sounding. And that may be because we've got the, the classic kind of basement channel in there, and that gives it more bass response. But, so um, the volume isn't that much different than now that I think about it. All right, so let's go back to the Plexi channel, I mean the JMP channel. And I'll give you the, this is the uh, treble. with and without the, uh, the, the uh, bright switch on. So uh, let's give it just a little bit of reverb, I guess, so you can see what it feels like with a little bit of reverb.
goes through the plexi. So now we're going to take a quick break, and I'm going to switch to the uh, get the SG, and we'll give you what it sounds like with the humbuckers. All right, back with the SG. Um, this is on the bridge pickup. Put a little bit of the treble. Yeah, I almost don't need that. That's pretty harsh still. Try the JMP. Do the neck pickup. Got it. Yeah, definitely a different tone structure to it. So, um, that one does like that bright a little bit more. I think the uh, bright switch gives it a little bit more. Put a little reverb on this one again and try both of those as well. Alright, back to the yeah, flexi. Alrighty, so there you have it. There's the demo of the Marshall Duel. I really dig the way that the kind of grind is on this one. I think I might prefer the Plexi myself, but I think some of the people that want more high gain can go for the, you know, the JMP style 2204, 2205, and then just give it a, a, another distortion pedal in front of it. But uh, that still has both of them have really good drive built into them, and then you just could notch them up more with some cool pedals. So thanks everybody for coming along on the journey. Uh, hope you enjoyed the build. Please give me a like, a subscribe, and a thumbs up, and I'd be more than happy to continue providing you guys more stuff. So thanks again. Cheers.